This is Troy with Rocky Mountain Motorcycle. We've got our 890 Adventure R uh, 2021. And today we're going to talk about this Giddy Outback Trekker uh, top box. So here's the 890 with that new box on it. That's yeah, pretty good size when you're just looking at it. When you're actually riding with it on, you don't really notice it at all. Obviously when we get off into the dirt, it'll all be determined on how much weight is in it for if you really notice it or not. Um, the box, my dad's just saying right now, you can't even tell it's there if just for, for just riding with it. Uh, it's the Givy Trekker. Uh, I think they call it a Trekker Outback or something like that. So to install it on the 890 is a little bit of a pain. You have to you have to buy the box, obviously, and then there's a, a kind of a quick release mount. We put the I think it's an M8. I'll put it up on the screen when I when I actually publish this. I think it's an M8 um, mounting bracket. And I think you can use a M9 or I think a handful of them will, will all work. But in order to get it to work on the 890, you also have to buy, I think they called it like an adapter or a mounting hardware. And uh, it's basically two pieces of, of metal that hook on to the original bracket that the 890 has that then hook onto there. So it, it kind of changes the angle just slightly and uh, just gives it some place to mount to. So it really takes three things, and I'll list all three of those things that we've got on there in order to mount it on the 890. They have a handful of different sizes. I think this one's called a 58, uh, 58 liter. And the reason we opted to do that size on it this time for this one, even though it's, uh, it's pretty big for, for most stuff you'd really need on, a, on an adventure bike, but it will fit two street helmets in it so my mom and dad like to take that and just the two of them without a lot of other stuff and uh, cruise the canyons right by our houses and things like that it's nice to be able to when you stop in some place to grab lunch or whatever to be able to throw both helmets in the box and lock it up uh, which is pretty convenient to do so that's why we got the big one they make smaller ones that'll fit one helmet or uh, a lot of different sizes of if you go look at different brands but that seemed to be our our best choice for for that for now anyway here's an up close look at the Gibby outback trekker or trekker outback on ours we went ahead and put this backrest piece on it you can see that right here it's a uh, about $60 to add that on to the order. This is the 58 liter, which we'll put two helmets in. For opening it up, just like most any top box, simply just opens up like that. You'll see inside. For removing the it off of the bike. It's also pretty simple. As easy as that to get it off. Same thing going back on. So simple. Let me show you the mounting that I talked about on the bike. This is the M8B, meaning black uh, plate, and if you look closely in here, right underneath here, this these pieces of metal, and I don't know if you can really see them too good in the video, these are that extra bracket that I talked about 
that you have to add on in order to mount the the main bracket on top of so all right thanks for watching